paintings to show you today. These paintings came from Everyday Eve Crafts. So let's jump right in, shall we? This one, I love the colors. I like it. Let's see, let me bring you closer if you're a little far away. Hmm. Need makeup. It's been a long time since I've put makeup on my face. I've gotten so lazy. Oh, makes me look more tired when I don't wear makeup. I really do have eyelashes. Alright, there we go. This is a special drill, 30 by 30, as you can see. I love the colors on this so much. There are 10 different stones that we will be looking at here. Really pretty. So let's take a look. We have our PJ packaging which is pretty understandable. Brain quit working for a minute. Um, the DMC codes are really hard to match. I know there are some companies that do match the DMC codes to their rhinestones, but for the majority, they do not. And of course, when you have the special shapes, you can't have a DMC code for that, so it's kind of pointless. Anyway, moving on. So first of all, we have beautiful white pearl teardrops. Then we have the champagne colored marquee, little baby marquees. We have the orange teardrops and red AB marquees. Then we have the bigger stones in red and champagne. And it's more yellow than champagne but it's kind of along those lines, pale or yellow. Then we have purpley pink and yellow, then red and crystal. The next one, if you've been watching me for long, you know that this is one of my favorite. Say hi. Look at your face. Oh. This is one of my favorite <laughs> owls, and I have her done in several different um, <laughs> styles. I think I have three different ones of her, but anyway. Um, so as you can see, this is a clock. It is a full drill clock face, which I'm very excited about. Super cute. So 30 by 30. And there is a spot in the center that you can actually put a hole so you can get the, um, the work, the mechanism through there. I'm super stoked about this one. Very, very happy about this one. It is regular drills, round. And we have 18 colors. And it looks like the DMC codes are on the packaging, which is nice because they are not on the canvas. All right, I have one that just fell out here. So they have a beautiful peach color that is number 16, I'm assuming. Right? Isn't that a pretty color though? That is so pretty. That looks like orange sorbet to me. Melted orange sorbet. <laughs> All right, so we have black and two shades of gray. Then we have kind of a orangey red, rust and a lighter, or a, not lighter, that's darker. Another orangey sorbet color, darker. We have a beautiful bright yellow and very pale gray. Gorgeous cranberry. And then a red, berry red, kind of, kind of a holly berry red. Then we have a beautiful bright blue. And then two kind of beige tones. 
we have two shades of blue here. Oh my. Oh, okay. So this is what is listed as number 16. So this is supposed to be the actual 16. <laughs> Three whole drills. <laughs> Scared me for a minute. And then we have a brown and a white. So there we have the colors. Really nice. I love that bright yellow. Those are just going to be like the little specks in her wings. And this orangey color, number six. Oh, that's the branch. And then, okay, so the the darker sorbet kind of color is the little light spots you see on the bottom of her wing tip. And then um, some of it up here in this thicker branch. And then the lighter peach is the shading in the clock face. So that's going to be, the colors are not what they look like on the canvas. So kind of a little pleasant surprise there. So it will be more of an orange picture than cream, which is kind of cool. All right, so let's put this away. Oops, I don't want to forget those. All righty. Then we have one more to look at. Another of my favorite subject matter. She's gorgeous. Look how beautiful. She looks kind of angry. But she's so pretty. And she is a partial. I love the colors. Her little rainbow tail feathers going on there. Really cute. Okay, so we have 13 stones on this painting. She is a 30 by 40. The other two were 30 by 30s, if you couldn't tell. I don't remember if I said that or not. Okay, so first of all, we have the blue AB pearls. And then we have a dark, dark red rhinestone, and then a beautiful green. Yay! I love getting brown ones because they're very rare. So we have orange and brown, purple and awesome yellow. I love those two colors together. Those look like, um, is it New Orleans? I don't know what what team that is. Is it football? Those are their colors. Lions. I want to say lions. I'm not a football person, but I that team stands out to me because I love these two colors together. I think it's lions. Is it New Orleans? I don't know. I'm gonna have to look that up now. <gasps> look at those. Those are pretty. So this pretty turquoise and these beautiful pale yellow pearls. That is the first of me seeing these. I have never gotten these before in a diamond painting. And that will be around her eyes. I love those. And then we have a blue, just a regular blue marquee. And then we have the purple A, B our standard talon stones. I have so many of these leftovers because I've got so many owl paintings, I've done so many owl paintings. They're always the beak and the talon or the claws, whatever you want to call them for the owls. All right, these are AB crystal teardrops. It's hard to, most of them are turned the wrong direction. So it's hard to see the finish on them. There's some you can see there. There we go. I love the yellow. It's so pretty. All right, so let's take a look at the canvas again. I love the background on this. 
nice and soft, kind of like a watercolor look to it. And then she's just like, boom, all that color. So pretty. Okay. Then we have the owl clock. Super cute. And our beautiful mandala. Very rich in the deep reds and yellows. Super pretty. All right, so make sure you check the out the link below. Um, go see for yourself all the awesomeness that they have on their site. You will spend hours, I'm just gonna warn you now, you'll spend forever. It's so hard to not go crazy and spend like $500. One of everything, please. I don't know where I'm going to go with it. Anyway, so there you have it. I will see you hopefully very soon. Take care. Come see me on Facebook.